Hey guys, welcome to Sound Pure. I'm Barry, and in this video, we'll be looking at uh, DW snare drums. This particular one is out of the Collector series, and this is the solid aluminum. Uh, the solid aluminum is different from the, the traditional thin aluminum. Is this guy is actually a cast three millimeter shell. Uh, there's no reinforcing rings, uh, and there's no flanges at the top and the bottom of the shell, so there's uh, no disruption of the airflow of top to bottom, giving you just a slightly broader and wider tuning range than you find from some of the metal shells. Uh, so you know the cast shell is slightly different from from most. Uh, again. Uh, Thin, thin shell drums in, in, the, in the fact that cast is actually um, a separate cast and they actually pour molten metal into, into the cast. It's then finally cooled and then they actually mill it down to exacting specifications. And again, this particular one is three mil, uh, roughly about an eighth of an inch thick. Uh, so again, just uh, absolutely incredible. Um, you know, this, this shell wall just has a very nice full body note and uh, an exacting tone. Uh, for you dynamic players, it adds a little bit more focus, and for you guys that are you live players that swing from another zip code, it's just going to give you a lot more projection and pop. Uh, this, is a, this is a 10 lug drum, giving you a really nice even stretch on the drum heads, uh, so whether you like the high registry or the, or the low registry, it's going to hold it there. One of the things that I do like about this particular drum as well, in the three millimeters that I've found, is that uh, they hold more definition and shape of that, at that lower registry. Uh, they've added ABS washers here, uh, so there's no metal to metal contact. And you've got the True Pitch 50, so it uh, helps you kind of fine tune your, your exact tuning uh, at a very granular level. We've got the True Hoops here, uh, kind of splits the difference between a uh, flange tube and a die cast tube. Uh, again, so for you guys that like the side sticking or rim shots, it's just a little bit more emphasis here at the top. We've got the mag throw off here, it's just a really quiet and easy functioning piece. Uh, it's just drawbridge style with the uh, sensitivity dial on this side. They've added a three position butt plate here for you guys that uh, need a little bit more flexibility in your snare wire settings. You've got, a, um, you've got just a little bit more flexibility again with, with the flip of a dial. The ship's with uh, uh, Remo heads, it's a coated ambassador top and the snare side ambassador bottom and then 20 strand wires. This drum is available on our Try Before You Buy program. It's a hassle free way to get this drum in your own hands and really appreciate and understand the nuances of this instrument at your own pace. I'm going to run this drum through a couple of different tuning examples to kind of give you an idea of what it's capable of. I'll be right back. So that was the DW 65 by 14 Collector Series snare drum again. This is the uh, solid aluminum, uh, slightly different from the thin. Again, this is a three millimeter shell. It's not for the faint of heart. Uh, this is uh, uh, just a beefier sounding drum. Uh, just what I loved about the aluminum is just uh, this kind of maple kind of uh, metal kind of hybrid sound that it has. Uh, and the lower registry does have this kind of uh, um, woodier sound and then the higher registry does get that metallic bite that you would expect. Uh, and again, at the three millimeters, it really holds a really nice uh, bit of shape and definition throughout the tuning ranges. So that low registry, again, is one of those uh, litmus tests for me as to whether a drum is worth its salt. This guy here holds that definition. It's just a really, really nice, precise note at that lower registry, but again, at that re higher registry as well, not a problem. Keep in mind that we're always looking for quality trades, so if you find yourself not using something, give us a call. We'll get you traded up. And if you like the video, please subscribe below. Don't forget to follow us on social media. 
You can stay up to date with the latest arrivals as well as current news. Thanks for watching.